Speaking of excited, I'm always excited to talk spirits. My play is Diageo, who owns brands such as Tanqueray Gin, Johnny Walker Scotch, Don Julio Tequila, and Kettle One Vodka. Shares for the most part flat today, but spirits overall are spiking. For the first time ever, spirits have overtaken beer in the alcoholic beverage market. That's major. Data from the Distilled Spirits Council shows spirits have a 42.1 share to beers 41.9, so it's very close, but they did eclipse them. Where they're headed is the key here. For context, in 1999, Beer had 56% of the market against 28% for spirits, so headed in the opposite direction quickly. You'll see plenty of beer ads, meanwhile, on Sunday, but spirits also made the big game. Diageo has a Crown Royal ad starring the Foo Fighters' Dave Grohl, also an ad for the House of Remy Martin. Diageo shares fractionally down today, down around 3% this year, but that really tells you a lot about the momentum of the spirits industry. It's odd, though, because the only one that really is growing exponentially is tequila. The other ones are relatively flat, small, single-digit gains, where tequila has been a rocket ship. Yeah, that certainly has been driving the gains as of late. When you take a look at how popular spirits are today compared to what we've seen in the past, they've actually been steadily increasing their market share for the past 13 years in a row. So this wow. momentum has certainly uh, started a while ago and seems to be carrying through here. I wonder how much the younger generation has to play with this, just in terms of their their preference for more options. They love the canned mm -hmm. cocktail. I know we're not specifically talking about that with Diageo, but certainly the rise of popularity of that helping the spirit business overall. And we're seeing that reflected in these numbers. We've got a young person. Oh, yeah. You're both I, young people. I would, I'm a Kettle One girl through and through. <laughs> I've always been. I love Kettle One. But my friends, I've noticed an uptick in tequila in particular. Yeah, yeah. I just think yeah. it's branded as the healthier choice, too. And I know wellness has sort of been a big trend mm -hmm. over the past decade or so. So that could play into it. But I'm happy Spears is making a comeback. I prefer it to beer. I'm Tito's and I know Dave hates Tito's. <laughs> Right? That's not I like true. I didn't, think you, were, I didn't no, think you were a big Tito's no, fan. I like All right, Tito's. I stand I'm just corrected. A equal opportunity. I stand corrected. <laughs> no, that is true. I'm a tequila man, <laughs> frankly.